Whenever you're ready. Fan of the Hauraki Big Show podcast? Hell Make sure yeah. you check out more from Jay, Mike and Keezy on their Instagram yeah. at or Hauraki not. Big Show. Or tune in to them 4 to 7 every weekday on Radio Hauraki. Thanks, mate. See old Keezy all zhuzhed up there, Mogi. Yeah, but what's happening with his hair? <laughs> I don't know, it's a bit of a... Yeah, what is going on with your hair, Keezy? What do very, you, uh, well, you haven't very, got the normal... You normally have some product in there, but I don't think you've got any it's in It's very today. buffy today. You call me a buff head? No, <laughs> I'm just saying it's very buffy. This is my hair. I have very it's fluffy not, it's hair. Not, but you, your difference between your buffy and your not buffy is very minimal. Right. It's only because we see you every day that we notice. Yeah. Uh, basically, oh no! I'd say it's really buffy. I'd say it's a massive difference. But also, that doesn't matter, right? It's just a new oh, hairstyle. I'm not saying it's good, bad, or indifferent. I'm Is just it a saying new it's, hairstyle? It's just quite sure. I mean, I was quite shocked when I saw it. Right. So basically, what happened is I—I mean, I recoiled. Jace, what happens is I hop out of the shower, instantly do my hair while it's wet, and then that stops it going buffy. Today, right. I hopped out of the shower, I had to piss around ironing my shirt and doing all this other stuff. And then by the time I put product in, it was a bit buffy, and I was like, you right. know what? Oh, right, it dried up a bit. Yeah, I'm just going to leave it a bit buffy today. I like it. Did sure. you have a shower today, Mogi? I've had a couple today. Did you? I always have two, at least. Do you seriously? Yep. I do. I have one in the morning. First thing? Depends. Usually first thing yeah. or after the gym, and then usually before I come in here. Mm. Then one before I go to bed, one after I've made love. And one after I've done my midnight steamer. Right, so yeah, five Can't a day. get up there. Yeah, Can't yeah. get up there. Yeah. yeah. You yeah. just leave the, the water running all day. Yeah, I know, I do. Yeah. I don't know what's happening with my power bill. I um, I don't shower till generally I'm coming into work. Right. You're in your PJs because you got your long nighty. Yes, and uh, my thing. Well, I'll go to the gym, but I still won't shower straight after the gym. Right. Why I'll not? Because well, you don't well, break a sweat. So. Uh, oh, yeah, true. yeah, that's true. I don't. There's no sweat going on. So, we yeah. And often, <laughs> I'll often go a weekend without a shower. No. Are you serious? Yeah. Or, I'll, you know, or I'll, and I'll say, well, I'll, say to, I'll say to my wife. My wife. You know, it'll be a Saturday night, and I go, God, I haven't showered today. And I'll, and I'll say to her. Is that gross? Do you want me to shower? And she'd be like, oh, I'm not going good. near you. So yeah, yeah. Weird. You're in it, the spare room. It is weird. It's like it's wrong that I'm showering twice a day. Mm. It's. Um, I remember a mate of mine had some Japanese exchange students come and stay with him. Um, and they were shocked at the amount of showering that was going on in that household. Right. He was, I think he's a twice a day as well. One, one in the morning and one before bed. They were once a week. Once a week, and you just use a flannel during the yes. rest of the week because it is a massive waste of water, and that's just we just think it's normal, but it's not. My father-in-law, or no, my stepdad, he showers once a week. Right. Monday, Monday morning. Treat yourself. Scrubs himself mm-hmm. like a bastard, and that's it for the week. But so, in order to do that, you would have to not work a very filthy job. Well, though. he's retired now. But if you're a but- tradie in Japan, you're just flanneling yourself down, are you? Uh, well, well that, I can't speak for all yeah, Japanese right. people, but these people, students, yeah. were horrified. Yeah. Mm. And I think there's I think some truth in that. And then also I think, uh, you know, the army shower is the go, which is where you get wet, you wet your flannel, then you turn the shower off, then you wash yourself, and then you rinse. Rinse yes. it off. So yeah. you haven't got – it's like also another thing that I do, which is terrible, two things actually. I never used to do – I used to do the army one, but I just got over it, uh, is – Shaving in the shower. I really want to start doing that. I bet oh, it's lovely. Oh, it's the best. Because I and, hate shaving. And brushing your teeth in the shower. I, wow. I always used to shave in the shower. I don't do that anymore. Oh, it's the I, best. I, I, I shave and in the sink. A, there. is, there's no bigger waste of water. Just than on that. the Japanese there. Wait, wait. They also think that um, having baths. Who, all of them? The implication being that they're wrong already. Uh, no, not at all. Okay. I agree with them. Having baths is disgusting. Right. How we sit in baths and wash ourselves and just sit in our own filth. Yeah, because what they do is they clean themselves first, then yes. hop in the onsen. Yeah. Well, not the guy that I see down at the um, down at the gym. He doesn't. Is he, he Japanese? Has a, he has a do you sa- get baths at your gym? Well, he has a sauna and then he jumps into a spa. So he's covered in sweat and yeah. then he jumps in the spa. Gross. That's what he likes doing. Gross. Uh, you I'm, see, if I'm covered in and sweat, I like I'm, giving a, him a I'm, I'm having a shower. Mine. Yeah. I don't want to jump with the sweat into a hot spa. Well, no, but it's like nobody wants your sweat in the spa yeah, either. That as well. That, more than anything. Mike, Disgusting. Do you have a mirror in your shower? No. Mate so, of mine had one, Raz. So how do you shave? 
Uh, by feel. Right. Yeah. You can tell. Yeah. You can tell. Like, you just go like, you're rubbing your face against the grain. Right, You can okay. feel it. Then as you rinse your face, you go, oh, I missed a spot. Right. Missed a spot. And, you, do and you, then you've got the razor beside the sink and you can do a touch-up if you need to, but generally Are you shaving be, cream? Shaving cream. Right. Oh, you yeah. see, I, I, I did have a mirror in the shower, so that was easy. Yeah, On the made floor of the shower, I, I you were saying. Because what I've found of late is I'm doing old man shaves. Really, well, missing heaps of missing patches. Missing heaps yeah. of patches. And, I can see and, that. I'll, and I'll look in there and i go, oh, for fuck's sake, look at that. That's yeah, a shocker. shocker. Missed a bit with the old that, Remington there. Uh, generally, you can line it up, generally you can line it up in your bathroom mirror somehow. You can normally open the old uh, vanity. Door. The vanity there. Oh, right, and, yeah. and you know, that's Oh, normal, swing it. But the, my one doesn't line up. It opens the wrong way. No, I'd actually have to come out of my shower and look around. Yeah. Into the mirror, yeah. See, so they, got, now I just do it in the sink, and I, I don't know. There's something a bit old school about it that I like. I've got an, I've got a handheld mirror, but I think it'll fog up really quickly, constantly. Well, well they've got does, the ones you that you can put, put in the there that you stick on the wall, and they uh, are anti that. Fog. Anti-fog. Literally, li- literally shaving sheer, like shaving mirrors. Right. Yeah. Okay. I might look into that. Pick them from a Briscoe's, for example. Because you know how quite often I'll come in here with a, sh- sh- a stubble. Mm. It's because I hate shaving. Whereas if I'm doing it in the shower, I might actually do it more often. Oh, it's good. Shaving in the shower is great. It's yes. like having a beersy in the shower. Yeah. Oh, shower beersy. So good. I saw a guy the other day that had installed a soap dispenser, but instead of putting soap in there, he put whiskey in it in the shower. <laughs> <laughs> and his missus thought it was so funny, but I bet she hates him being a massive alcoholic. <laughs> <laughs> I bet it still tastes I like that. slightly I like, that. like great. soap, though, as well. <laughs> yeah, yeah. yeah. Um, nice. Nice stuff, all right. The Hodaki Big Show with Jason Hoyt, Mike Manok, and Keezy. The Hodaki Big Show, weekdays at four on Radio Hodaki. What's the weirdest thing you've ever done in the shower? I don't really do anything weird in the shower. No, neither do I. And, you know, people often talk about making love in the shower. I've always found that shit. Well, it's never good. It's never, you know, you look at it in the movies and you go, ooh, steamy. It's not a good, uh, it's not a good, it's not a good lubricant. No, and uh, water. Well, and and I also find because you're both standing up as a general rule, it's very awkward. Oh, because you as well have to, or you without your sex swing as well, without you sitting easy, in the seat. Yeah, easy. true. What? That no, would be yeah. true. Yeah. Um, the best thing that I do in the shower is I empty out all the hair in the drain. Same. And I bin it. So you bin never, it, and I never say anything to my wife about it. That takes a lot. Because yeah. what happens is full, of backbone full I credit to my wife. She does that. I'm not touching that shit. Yeah. Well, I do it just so that she doesn't feel bad about it, you know? But also, so what happens is ours gets clogged with my partner's hair. I pull it out and then go, why does she never do this? And then I think of all the stuff she does do. And then I go, but you yeah, still who cares? You still, oh, still yeah. hit her up. So what right. I do is put it next to the plug hole. Yeah, my favourite year is when they just um, throw, throw, it it, throw it against the shower wall. Like yeah. they're going to get it later. But or they, they just leave it in the corner, just this big glutinous yeah. mass of soapy hair. Yeah. So good. You know what I've found, which is intriguing. Well, it's not intriguing. Pure you know, lice? When, you, when, you're cleaning, <laughs> when you're cleaning the head of your vacuum of cleaner your what? there. When you're cleaning the head of your vacuum. Because oh. mine was it's playing up on me at the moment. Still. And... And hey, I, you pull it all suggested out. that you see if there's anything blocking it, man. Well, I have Did you been check doing that? that. I've been checking every orifice. And a bee head. And you pull it out. And the amount of bloody long hair in there is extraordinary. Oh, they should be it's forced like to shave their heads. It's man. like it's they're shedding hair continuously. Because they are. Yeah, I guess they are. It's foul, every, isn't it? Every time you vacuum with your Dyson, do you have to pull the head apart and pull the hair off the roller? Over time, yes. Did I, I have to do it every time. Oh, I don't have to do it every Not time. Every time, that's no good. That's stupid. That's every why time. you meant to brush your hair five hundred times every night in front of the mirror, Keezy. So you should pass that on, right? Uh, to re- your wife. Re brushing hair. Yeah, re brushing. you just take the take note of this, right? Because you're thinking of having little With ones. Your buff hair. You're having little ones. Little buff heads. Some of the most <laughs> fucking miserable times. Was my three girls when they were little brushing their hair yep. to go to school? I do it every day. You would not believe the performances that I went on. Am, Nightmare. You, obviously, you had the three daughters in the house at once, so that's much tougher. Absolutely. Uh, the kids, pre- mine is pretty good. She'll have a day where she says, "Ow." Right, you know, no. Ow, even if I'm not even bothered, not even if I'm not even touching, touching her at that it. point. Yeah yeah, 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 yeah. But she's pretty. Considering how curly her hair is, she's pretty tolerant. Yeah. No, we had. I, I had one daughter in particular that fell apart right. every time you did her hair. <laughs> that would fall apart and scream and cry. Yeah. And my wife would be just going. Oh. 
Yeah, just cut uh, it off there. Uh, yeah. Well, because every time I pull the head of the vacuum cleaner apart, I go, look at how much of your hair is in here. And then Lucy will go, well, do you want me to have long hair or not? And I'm like, well, yeah. Do you? I, like, I like do your you? hair. Yeah, I like I, your hair. I, but also, I'm, I'm just saying, look dudes. at it. And also, I think there is. A th- I think you have to brush it every day, don't you? That's the thing with having long hair. You got to brush it every day and get all the shit out of it. Right. Oh the other God. hair, you know what I mean? Yeah. It's like dogs. Like my dog. It's the same thing. You got to brush it, otherwise the hair is everywhere. Yeah. Well, that's the other thing. Is bloody dog hair. Christ. Dog hair. Hey, question for you, Jace. You you're like me. You lay your clothes out. Yes. You lay your clothes out. Today I laid my clothes out before I came in here, and every single time I lay my clothes out, whether it's in the morning or later in the day. I will come out of the shower and my fucking dog will be lying on my clothes without fail. No? Ne- never happened to me. Jesus, it's a pain in the ass. Tinker. Never she, happened she to me. Misses Weirdly, me so, I mean, she pisses she me off. She misses me so much. Yeah, miss, uh, uh, everything else she pisses me off with, but no, she's never done that, weirdly, because I right, lay them out so. on my bed, Yeah, and she doesn't generally get on our bed. Right. Um, so... Yeah. Right, well, last go. night our smoke detector went off in the middle of the night Oh, for the second time, and it's a brand new smoke detector. Far out, man. That freaks you out. Oh, freaked our dog out too. Talk about yeah. That's when my dog Ooh. goes nuts if that goes off, and even more so. Like she's really good because if there's smoke in the oven, which we won't see, she starts whining. She starts going, and we're like, what the? And she gets angsty. Yeah, and it's because she knows that there's smoke in the in the oven, and when we open it up, off. and it's going to set that bastard off, and so she gets really worked up. <laughs> Why is there smoke in the oven? Because you're burning it, or does it need no, to clean? No, sometimes just filthy. It's just yeah, it's I just, bet it's filthy. Yeah. It, oh, I. And how often do you guys clean your oven? We're well, pretty, we're once quite a year. often. Oh, no, nah, we we do it once every couple of th- weeks. This is w- oh. one of the. Biggest revelations, I probably only because I hadn't thought of it. As soon as we went vegan slash vegetarian, you never, you practically never have to clean mm. your oven because all of that filth is just animal fat. Yeah, fat. It's yeah. unreal. So good. So good, and it is good. Oh, it's, wrong. Good it's delicious. Eating. In your yeah. case, it's keysy. It's what Hawaiian pizza. Yeah, yeah. 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 Like those little bits, <laughs> of, bits of those little bits of ham on there. Yeah. I yeah. genuinely had one of those and for burnt, lunch today. And burnt <laughs> cheese and pineapple. It was mm. lunchtime, and because I knew I had to get ready, to put my suit on. Blah blah. I was like, oh, I might get some sushi or something. And then I was like, oh, I can't be fucked. I'll just have a frozen pizza. And then I did, and it was delicious. Did you eat the whole thing? Yeah. Shit, yeah. They're not Easy. massive. And also a bit of lining, as you would say, Jace. Oh yeah, you're getting on the hammer tonight because we're getting steamed tonight. So I was I like, I'll have a like pizza and that all year. It's like. Chicken. Yeah, good stuff, Keezy. Your Horaki Big Show Keezy word of the day is. Duh. Here? Keezy negative. Ah, uh, you're here. <laughs> <laughs> oh, <oy. laughs> Fellas. Follow us. Horaki Show Big. Jason Hoyt, Mike Minogue, Chris. Thank you. Bye. Thanks, mate. 